a girl hey, How you want me? How you want me when you got a girl? A feeling is reckless Of knowing it's selfish of knowing I'm desperate Getting on Hi guys Wow, why am I looking so dark and ish? Am I really that dark? I don't know. Do I need more light? Probably. Just legit just got back from town. Um, huh. I'm actually scared for this video. I'm terrified. I went to Primark, so as you guys can see, I got a bag up. So I got as much of, as much stuff as I can to get as close to a full face as I possibly can. But we 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 gonna find out. We are gonna see how far we get with this. Actually, gonna let me put a head tie on in it because my my hair just be getting in the way all the time. Let's get into it. So the first thing that I got was the primer water. Now they did have a different primer but that one was like for dewy skin um i don't like dewy skin so it's prep skin for makeup application hydrates and refreshes silicone free alcohol free oil free so we are gonna try that primer water it just this might be just be water you know this just might be just water like you never know okay it smells does it say fragrance free it doesn't say fragrance free so it smell it has a fragrance to it i'm scared So I guess what they're doing here is mimicking the Smashbox primer water. The primer is a little bit tacky. It's not like fully set in. But I don't know if it'll do anything. We're gonna see, right? We're gonna see. So the next thing I'm gonna use is the medium brow pencil. Now this color seemed a bit off. I swatched it. It just looked like it was a bit too dark to be medium. So if they had a dark, I would be scared. I like this brow pencil because it comes with a spoolie. Hello. Okay. Hello. Hi. It's fantastic. It comes with the spoolie. Love it. I'm actually, even if this doesn't work, I'm actually going to keep this as my spoolie. Okay. So let's try it out. Okay. <laughs> I needed a dock. This is like grey. No, can you check this? Okay. <laughs> So my thoughts on this is it's just super creamy but not in a good way. It's like creamy not in a terrible way. It's just one of those pencils that you're gonna keep on having to sharpen. Um so for concealer, because y'all know I like to I need to conceal these brows. I actually got two concealers. This is somewhere I got struggled was with concealers, but I got two concealer pens. These are the Instant Fix Concealer Crayon. Um, I got them in the colours Warm Honey and Expresso. Warm Honey just looked too warm. Like, <laughs> let me tell you. It looked too warm. But I'm going to use it under my brows because I think that will work. And it's a stick. It's a crayon. Apparently we're going for a thick brow. This is actually quite creamy. This isn't bad. This is actually quite creamy And the color actually isn't that bad as it looked in store Not good for precision. I'm not gonna lie As you blend it out, it's definitely just like, you can see how light it is. Okay, my eyebrows are a lot thicker, a lot fuller than what I usually like them. So I'm gonna grab a more precise brush because I can't, the, the end is looking like one snail like. <laughs> Mm. 
let me just recognize that I'm just not gonna get the brow shape that I want out of this so next that i got was the perfect color foundation i actually got three shades and i believe these are like three of the darkest shades so these lots right here so i got the colors amber honey cool espresso and rich es espresso rich espresso sis rich es espresso looks too dark for me and um, the color that actually looks like will be good for me is cool espresso um, it's a, it says it's a perfect finish foundation, medium coverage, semi matte finish. So yeah, I'm gonna give it a shake. So I'm just gonna squeeze it on my face actually. Hold on. Let's see how far we get with this. Don't, okay, it smells like lotion. You get 30, 35 mils, that's quite a lot for £2.50 It's blending right into my skin like, I don't see no differences than my skin in this foundation All right, I wouldn't say this is medium coverage I would say this is light coverage but we're going to do some layers and see how far we get with this. You're going to use quite a lot of this to get a desired coverage if you're anything like me. Okay. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. We get in that slide slide coverage. Okay, that coverage is not bad. And I feel like this mixed with my Black Opal Stick Foundation, you might be onto a winner. I'm not gonna do it today, but one of these days I'm gonna try it out when I'm just at home and bored. I actually have work today, so I don't even know, because if this makeup turns out rubbish, <laughs> we shall see. So I'm actually gonna go in with this crayon, the Warm Honey Crayon, and let's see how far we get with this. I hate, hate, anything cream highlight hate it so we're gonna blend this out and actually set it um before i go in by the way i couldn't find um a loose like baking setting powder type of thing they only had press and i don't like to use that personally and i know they had some pressed loose powders on their website but of course I didn't have time. So I'm going to use just a cheapish one. I love this one. This is the Airspun Loose Face Powder. I love this stuff. So I'm actually just going to use this instead of the whatever. Yeah, I'm going to use this as my setting powder. It's cheap. It's not that expensive at all. So we should be all good. This blended right in. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing just as yet. That's not that's not that bad, you know. I did get like a lighter foundation just in case I couldn't use any of these. Uh, this is an amber honey. But that's not bad. I definitely feel like I'm gonna have to kind of go over it a little bit just to give me more of a highlight. But this is not that bad. On camera, this doesn't look that bad. I'm not even gonna front. But in person, yeah. It's questionable, not gonna lie, it's a little questionable.
I haven't baked in so it's so long, but as soon as I put the powder to sit there, my eye makeup just went dry. So I got this. This is the compact powder that they have. Uh, this isn't a color chestnut. Now I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I I I, I kind of slightly swatched it in store. Comes with a mirror. That's really cute. It comes with a little what's this spongy tip thing. That looks like I could set my under eye with it um okay I feel like this is way too light for my skin oh. sis the amount of powder for that I'm getting from this is crazy hey guys why do I look like Casper the ghost on camera it doesn't look bad but I promise you in person I just I wouldn't even do you know what I mean like I just wouldn't I wouldn't even okay the color is all wrong so what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go in with my normal press powder because sis in hopes that will fix that because I think it was this powder this powder is no good we're gonna soldier on okay we're gonna soldier on this i'm actually quite excited for because the palette looks promising right so this is the master palette eye palette uh and this was actually six pounds you guys so this is actually the most i've spent at all today for anything from primark so this was six pounds you get 12 is it 12 wait four three yeah you get 12 and the casing is very 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 sturdy and it's really it's a really cute palette like it's a really cute palette the colors are really cute like this is a cute this is a cute palette i can see myself using this right here first this one right here oh okay we've got a lot of kickback as you guys can see on the brush maybe my lights are a bit too bright for you guys to see let me show you guys you guys see that kickback quite a lot of kickback okay and Oh, okay, here we go. Here is that pigment. Going with this top shade here. Oh. You really have to tap these. Okay, because there's not that many variations of shade in here. I'm actually just gonna go straight over my eye with a shimmer shadow. I just don't know which one I want to use yet. I'm gonna start off with this one, see how far we get with that one. I'm gonna try to use the brush wet, oh uh, no, dry to begin with. See how far that gets us. That's not that bad, that's not bad. Let me just do the other eye real quick and then we'll try it wet. I'm gonna use the uh, primer water for that. Um, <laughs> I mean, do you guys see the difference? I don't see the difference. Let's try with my finger. See how far that gets us. Okay, we're getting somewhere, but not where nearly where I need to be. Like, do you know what I mean? And we're just going to go in with that dark shade, that dark brown shade in the front. I mean, it's not bad, it's just not nothing special to be honest with you guys. Alright, so I got some liner, I got a felt tip liner, I didn't get a liquid liner. They didn't have one, I know they have one, but they didn't have it in stock. But, okay, that's long! yes i like it it's, it's nice and black like it just gets the job done like can you cry about that the last thing i'm just gonna put on before i go off camera and do my finish off my eyebrows at least try to save them as much as i can and my eyelashes is this false lash effect extreme length definition volume mascara so we're gonna try it out with mascara though i'm not really fussed The 
do I see a difference? No, I don't. But okay. To be honest with you, when it comes to mascara, I'm not fussed because a lot, a lot of mascaras, high end, low end, don't do anything for my lashes at all. Like I just have very, very small lashes. Period. On. I didn't get um any eyelashes from Primark, by the way. Just letting you know. Right, for contour, I think I'm just going to use my own contour powder because it's just going to be easier that way. And then also for bronzer, they didn't have one, so I'm just going to use my CoverGirl one. So for highlight, I'm going to try and use the eyeshadow. If it does, that doesn't work, then I'm just going to go with my own one. I'm going to try and use this shade right here. We'll see how far we get with that. That's actually, that's actually pretty, I like that, oh this is beautiful, this is nice, I like this, oh, oh, hmm, see, so I'm just going to go over the top a little bit with Laura Geller Gilded Honey, which is what I would do anyway, I never just wear one highlighter and call it a day, I always wear two, that's blinding you. I don't even care. I know that's blinding you right now. Don't even act like it's not blinding you, because it is. So I've got the PS Workout Fix Up Makeup and Setting Spray. This was two pounds. It soaked up majority of that powder. Definitely has done that. So I'm just gonna put some highlight on my nose. This is Laura Geller, by the way. Next thing is blush. Now, Tammy Clark here on YouTube, I think, is it Tam does she go by Tammy Clark on YouTube or makeup by Tammy? I can't remember. But she actually raves about this blush. I can't remember if, 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 if it. I can't remember if it's this specific colour, but she always raves about Primark blush, Primark blush. So this isn't a colour adored. This was £1.50 and it looks like this. It's just a pinky blush. This is coming off a little bit ashy on me, I'm not going to lie, so I'm not going to put any more, I'm just going to blend it. It's coming out ashy on me, that's not cute. So the last thing that we've got to do is our lips. So I've got a red lipstick, which I don't actually think I'm going to use, but this formula is actually really nice. So this is the Super Matte Liquid Lipstick, this was £2, this was also £2. Uh, yeah, let's try it out, why not? The packaging's cute. Packaging is cute, it's just in a square thing. And when I switched the colour in store, it looked like my type of colour. So this is a Carla, Carla. Yeah. And I also got a lipstick, no, a liner. This is in the colour Toffee. I think this is the darkest they had. Okay, it looks kind of like a terracotta colour. So we're going to try and go in with the super matte liquid lipstick, see how that goes. I like the little tip on it I must say though the formula on this doesn't feel nearly as nice as the formula on this when I swatched it I'm just saying by Barry M I'm just gonna use the, the pencil in this this should be dark enough I think that's everything that I bought. So let me just take off this headscarf and I'll be back with my final thoughts. Okay, and we are back. I am not mad at it. I don't know what it looks like on camera, but in the viewfinder, it doesn't look half that bad. The only thing that I'm not loving is the eyebrows. I hate the eyebrows. I hate the shape right now. I hate the pencil. The lipstick I love. The foundation, not that bad. It's medium coverage, definitely buildable. So, it, no, sorry, it's light coverage, buildable to a medium coverage. That's what I would say about the foundations. Um, the little face powder, no, just a waste of your time. Waste of my time. Come back real quick, because after taking my pictures, I am not mad at Primark. I'm not mad at them. Like, this this is not bad. This is actually not bad. Bear in mind I did use a couple of my own stuff, but 
the foundation the base the highlight under my eyes is not bad i'm actually not mad at it i'm really not after taking my pictures i'm happy with primark y'all this is good this is a good start like if you're someone who wants affordable makeup you know and and is not really willing to splurge as much this might be a good alternative i'm not even gonna front this might be a really good alternative so i'm not i'm I'm not mad at Primark. I really want to be mad at them, but I'm not mad. I'm really, really, really not mad at them. Like, this is... This is good. Like, I'm not mad. And the highlights should popping. I'm not mad. That was a full face... Well, kind of a full... Kind of, kind of. A full face using Primark makeup. I hope you guys enjoyed. And, um... Yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe for more videos for more. Um, if you whilst you're here, why not check out the rest of my videos? Why not, sis? Why not? Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.